Hey there, Libra. It's A Drizzy, also known as the sweetest spiritual gangsta. I'm back with another message of love. This is for you and your person and what they want to say to you. Okay, the next uh, 96 hours. Um, if this resonates, definitely like, share, and subscribe. Um, and if it doesn't, definitely check out your sun, moon, or rising sign. Okay, or you could also check me out. Um, on another video coming up or you could also book me on my site okay that is tagged below in the description box but let's get right into it anyways let's see what your person wants to say to you okay this is going to be for your sun moon rising sign and libra show me what we need to see for libra and their person what do they need to be warned about this weekend libra and their person what does libra need to be warned about regarding their person what does spirit want to show libra regarding them and their person show me what does spirit want to show all my libras okay all right we have oops. dog barking advice from a friend okay so you could be giving advice or seeking advice from a friend okay you could be that friend giving it show me what else we have cobweb protected from negative forces beyond your control so know that you are protected okay i feel like maybe there's um advice from a friend that's actually coming in okay that's actually protecting someone okay from negative forces show me what else fear worries intense situations okay so that could be happening around you we also have firecracker we have excitement okay we also have dark woman dealings a relationship with a dark woman with a uh, dark uh, blah, 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 blah. dealings a relationship with a woman with dark complexion or hair. OK, so someone could be a darker skin tone. OK, or someone could be um, more so just with dark hair. But I do feel like this person either way is protected. OK, you are protected. This other person is. Show me what else. We have sun, sunrise, new creative ideas, new ventures, and a fresh start. So I feel like maybe someone's fearing, okay, about a fresh start with you, okay? Or you could be feeling a fresh start with someone. You could be getting advice from someone, okay, that wants a fresh start with you. Or uh, uh, you, there, you could be getting advice from someone that wants a fresh start with you, okay? Kind of talk, talking to you, seeing where things are. But I feel like you might have anxiety about that, okay? We do have overall woman, dealings or relationship with a woman, yeah. So I feel like definitely either this could be a, a, a same sex connection or i feel like this more so could be about um two people coming together okay maybe um two women giving advice okay i feel like there's a lot of excitement within the air this could be two best friends okay that are trying to bounce ideas off of one another okay but someone's very nervous um overall we do have wait wrong deck hold on overall energy we do have a wish will be granted split the deck someone is trying to come between you or something that you want wedge and then top of the deck we do have torch spiritual development enlightenment and awareness and understanding okay so i feel like that's what the situation is coming with okay so do be aware of that in the next couple of days show me what we need to see regarding um all of my libras all around the world um Give me a specific message, okay, or a collective message. What do all of my Scorpios need to know and understand? What do my Scorpios need to know? Oh, Scorpio. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. What do my Libras need to know and understand? What do all of my Libras need to know and understand? Moving on, okay. I don't know if maybe there's someone from your past that's visiting, okay. I but and within within love, there's a state of you needing to move forward and move on. I feel like there's someone that either puts you in a very conflicted state, or I feel like um, you've been waiting around for something for a very long time, okay. With uh, another person, could have been eight years that you've been waiting for them, okay. Maybe ten years, six years, uh, but I feel like there's been a waiting game, okay, based off of what's going to happen in this connection okay i feel like maybe you've been putting yourself in a lot of predicaments where i feel like you've been having to wait and watch and see how things go and i think you're finally moving past that type of energy show me one more yeah standing your ground you're definitely making more boundaries within this dynamic now because i feel like you're realizing what you've lost in the past i feel like you're definitely opening your heart to kind of communicating what is on your mind but i feel like that little space uh, you know, peace inside you still kind of keeps you in a state of waiting for something to happen instead of making it happen. Okay, show me what else is going on. I don't know if you hear there's a kid crying, one of my neighbors, <laughs> they're very upset if you hear that. But yeah, we have recognition and reward. Okay, I feel like also maybe there's been a lot of frustration when it comes to um, 
feeling like you've been recognized, feeling like you're appreciated, okay? I feel like you are very wise and you have a lot to bring to the table, but I feel like maybe not a lot of people have uh, made you feel like you're you're appreciated, okay? You are a Libra. You are the scales, okay? You are the balance of, you know, equilibrium. And I feel like that's something that you do, you need to maybe give yourself. I feel like, um, I feel like also people don't recognize maybe the opportunities and, and the things that you have moved past. Or maybe you need to give yourself recognition for the things that you have not let defeated you, okay? What is the waiting game? Yeah. I feel like something about you intuitively waiting for something to come in towards you, okay, by itself, that's what's going to keep you stuck a little bit, okay? That's the thing that's keep you, kept you defeated is waiting for something to come for you instead of going and getting it yourself, okay? And I feel like also there's a sense of maybe having a good discernment for who you are uniting with, okay? I feel like also it's about waiting around for that perfect person instead of trying to make that person perfect, that perfect person happen. I feel like now you're just letting it flow. You're letting it go. Oh, I feel like you've suffered in silence enough. You've hurt enough. And I feel like you're finally actually getting up those those steps that you tripped over so many times. OK, yeah. Based off the decisions you're speaking now, you're letting people know again, five, six, seven. I feel like you making more decisions about your life is going to have you in the best area that you can be, okay? Starting a new thing, or I mean, not a new thing, starting a new plan for yourself, okay? Especially regarding love, okay? But overall, we have heartache and loss, and we have balance. So I feel like, again, you're finally having or finding a balance within the hurt that you have had, and you're using it as power, okay? Instead of letting it defeat you. And I feel like that's the one thing that's actually going to really help you soon and really transform you into the person you're supposed to be. But let's get into it. Let's see what your person wants to say to you. Uh, for all my Libras, what does the person on your mind want to say to you? All my Libras, the person on your mind, what do they want to say to you truly? Open relationship, okay? So you could be in an open relationship with this person. Maybe they're expressing that they want an open relationship. Maybe they're not looking for anything too serious. Show me what else. Three weeks, okay? Maybe you're seeing someone in three weeks, okay? Maybe you met someone three weeks ago and you're kind of clarifying about what the state of the relationship is. Maybe you clarify that something's a, uh, a relation, an open relationship three weeks ago. Yeah, we also have, I want you to explain yourself. Yeah, so maybe someone also... Um, maybe someone you could be meeting this person in three weeks someone wants you to explain yourself on why maybe you do want a connection i feel like also um maybe there's there's an open relationship that has been going on for three weeks now but someone's finding out about and someone's like i want you to explain yourself what's going on show me what else is going on for all of my libras in their person don't hate the player hate the game right someone's finding out that there was maybe another relationship in the midst and someone's like well you ain't tell me about that like i know that we're not serious but i didn't know you were dating other people i feel like that's something that is coming up okay we do have tall so this person could be of a tall stature okay show me what else is going on here for all of my libras the person truly on their mind show me their truth feeling too logical yeah so this person's feeling like way too to the point okay i feel like someone's thinking way too uh, not even thinking but someone's emotionally feeling way too exact like their their emotions are like well i'm sad you know and i, I feel like it's because this person like they're i feel like this person's feeling way too logical about why they're feeling the way they are it's like they're analyzing themselves over and over right you and this person don't share the same vision and i feel like that's kind of an issue i feel like that's what this person's feeling what the differences is what makes you different they're like overthinking and I feel like they want to I feel like they want to know what you're doing okay I think about you all the time right show me what else is this person feeling for all my Libras what is this person feeling for all my Libras I admire you so much and what else does this person want to say to all my Libras what is their truth what is their truth young woman okay what about young woman is there truth can you clarify this this connection surprised the hell out of me yeah so either you are the young woman okay that this person is surprised by or you could be a um a young woman um or this person could be a young woman and you could be a masculine and they're just very surprised about this. I feel like they didn't want anything to be too crazy, but I feel like even just after these three weeks, they're feeling very strongly about you, but they know that there's differences. They know that you want maybe different things. Yeah, but they feel like you guys work well together. Show me what else is this person feeling. Show me their truth. What else are they feeling? What else are they feeling? What else are they truly feeling? 
I dream about you at night. Okay, so they could be dream traveling. You could be noticing this person showing up in your dreams and shit. And you're like, wait, what are they doing in there? Show me what else is going on. We have regret. Someone is feeling regretful about how they've treated you, right? And show me two more messages for the overall energy. Wishing on a star about you, okay? And show me one more. Two more. I've been through a lot. I need to heal, but I want to be happy with you. You were the best thing that ever happened to me. Yeah. So I feel like this person is just trying to heal. Maybe they got out of a relationship three weeks ago, and I feel like that's why they are trying to say, I only want an open relationship. Or maybe someone's finally clarifying what they do desire, but I feel like they do still want you. Let's see what energy is coming up. For all of my um, Libras. Okay, express your love, heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with one another. And let's clarify one more for what's coming up. Yeah, because this could be the one, right? You've met, you've already met the romantic partner you seek overall. New love, yeah. So this is definitely someone new that you're meeting, okay? And I feel like they're into you just as much as you're into them. Show me what is the next moves, okay? Show me what the next moves are. This person's fighting for you, okay? But they're, they're I feel like they're, 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 they're feeling a little tired, okay? A little worn out, a little left out in the cold, okay? I feel like they're gonna continue to reach out to you, but I feel like they're tired of either reaching out first or um, feeling kind of left out of your energy. All right, show me what else. Yeah, they want healing. This could be an Aquarius, okay? Show me what else yeah this person's really wanting to nurture and birth something really nice with this connection and grow it okay i feel like someone is really seeing this as something fruitful something of value okay i feel like that's intuitively what they know but they also know that there's other people that you do desire okay i feel like there's other people that you're maybe trying to make fight for for the relationship to show there it's like prove it to me I feel like that's what they know that you're in that mode because, again, you have been hurt. You are emotionally closed off. And I feel like you do want something emotionally stable, but someone feels like also you're very not, you're not emotionally open for this person or you're not um, emotionally available. Is that what it is? Right. Because of what you've just walked away from or what they've walked away from. Yeah, they want to invest, but I feel like you're going to sense a, um, an energy of rejection, but only because of what has previously happened or what they're previously going through. OK, or what they're trying to grow towards. I feel like they have a very indecisive energy and I feel like they don't really have a goal of what their their end point or their checkpoint is when it comes to love. And that's the issue. So I feel like you're kind of going to feel in limbo. But this is something new and something fun. OK. Okay, show me what else is coming in rest and relaxation so again maybe a little separate or maybe you guys are just choosing time to relax we have again solitude meditation yeah i feel like it's more so you guys kind of staying alone or meditating on what you really need to we have special knowledge and skills and spiritual enlightenment right you're seeing what you need to from this person or about this person okay while you're separate from them pretty much let's see put the fucking phone down right too much screen time is making you awkward and sad go to talk to a live person mm -hmm. and show me what you need to see for your angel number or angel answer reconsider okay so i feel like yeah spirit is saying to reconsider the situation okay let's confirm what reconsider is unlikely no need to worry yeah so i feel like it's unlikely that you're going to want to reconsider the situation and leave it all at a whole but i feel like there is not there's things that you don't really have to stress about you just have to let things go with their own control i feel like it's like you want to control the dynamic or this person might but you can't you just have to let it flow and that's something that's going to bother you but i feel like that's something you need to be aware of if you do want this but let's get an overall energy and that was for you libra overall energy for libras birth right what are we trying to birth with this situation okay it takes nine months to birth something that looks like you're taking up knitting maybe you're birthing a new you okay birthing new projects but i definitely feel like there's definitely a good energy coming in with this person but you do need to know what you are trying to bring into fruition what you're trying to bake okay what you're trying to bake into reality what are you trying to make into reality all that um but yeah that was for you i hope that helps in some way i'll be back soon with another message